Welcome back to Juice Labs. What's up, everybody? We're back with Umbrella Academy. I'm Clay. I'm Corey. Juice. I'm back here in Juice Labs South. Episode 7, Umbrella Academy. Episode 7. We had a lot happen last time. Five. Uh, he just, he took the deal. He took the deal? Mm-hmm. Seems like it's only, it's not good. And he has to travel to 1982, as far as we know. Things are wild. Things are pretty wild. Nobody says that. <laughs> I've never heard it, but I get it. Maybe that's a Wisconsin saying. Mm -hmm. Let's move on to Article 17, please. <laughs> oh, he's got to kill the whole commission. Oh, shit. <laughs> Holy oh, shit! Just with an axe? Wow. Oh, my God. How'd she die from that? <laughs> well, maybe she's sleepy. <laughs> Oh my god, he's out of his fucking Damn. mind! Axe murderer! <gasps> oh! Oh my god, there's a bunch of. Oh my god. I don't even understand that. Jim. I don't either, there's blood everywhere. Yeah. <laughs> oh, damn. damn! That stupid goldfish. Wow. Make sure you stomp on that thing. I'd make sure that thing's dead. That's what I'd be doing. Yep. I gotta focus on my polka. I ain't got time for this. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, I walk out, I see that. It's <laughs> me, it's me. It's me. <laughs> Y'all see some? <laughs> Where's the door back in? <laughs> Man, I really like seeing Five just go in like that. That was fucking awesome. We're just gonna let that one fly by. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah I'm not gonna touch it. Yeah. I'm not gonna touch it. Yeah. <clears throat> <laughs> Good work, Five. You got a sick piece on you. <laughs> yeah. She got a hell of a honker down there, huh, bud? Yep. Really coming into its own. She's really willing to make enemies with five right after he murdered a bunch of people with an axe. Yeah. Still got the blood on him. Murdered 12 people with an axe. Five's going crazy. Yeah. yeah. I like Five, though. He's, uh, he's always on like it. Him. Yeah. I don't know why he believes this is even going to work. Who knows what to believe? Time is weird. Yeah. I mean, I believe... Uh, what's her name? I keep forgetting her name. Lady got shot in the head. <laughs> Leader of the commission at this point. Why he believes her story is even going to work. What happens if the suitcase takes him to, you know... Dinosaurs. Sure, that's a waste of budget, Corey. <laughs> okay, then the twenties. <laughs> or it's just normal, but the apocalypse still happens. <laughs> yeah. Just reminds me of like uh, Plankton sneaking in his Robo crabs. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> what is the Krabby Patty secret formula? <laughs>
There's no way this doesn't go terribly in the future. I mean, this is probably nice. And Jill starts to fall in love with Klaus. Oh, yeah. It's they gotta cool. explain the whole situation. Well, maybe, uh... Maybe Klaus can do something, like, learn his powers more. Oh, yeah, I mean, you know. It just doesn't seem like it ends well for Ben. This guy's a wild card. Well, it would be much more of a wild... It would be a much more dangerous wild card situation if Vanya couldn't kill him at any moment if she really yeah, wanted to. Yeah, <laughs> if he pulls out a gun and shoots at her, she just stops the bullet. Yeah. And uses the sound to kill him. Yeah, either way... The problem is he could hurt Sissy. Yeah. And if she did kill him, Sissy's gonna leave the kid. Yeah. yeah. Well, that's all it what you want. But it ain't natural. I've been thinking of sending him off to the town. What? Where? Go to a facility better equipped to handle this kind of stuff. Be good for him. Get some special kids. Why, well, that's crazy. I wonder what this guy cares about. I wonder if he's mad he's losing his wife to someone else, or if because it, is it about the kid? Because he's willing to use the kid as a pawn to get her out of there and say, hey, I'll just ship him off. I was about to say, if there's someone that's better equipped to handle autism at this point, I would say it's not the worst thing if they brought the kid to that school. It's not, because there isn't anywhere better. But I know he meant it as yeah, to yeah. send him away. He meant it in a negative way. I don't know what his motivation is. Yeah. Does he just want, like, the just, so-called happy life? Yeah. I think he doesn't want the humiliation. A successful job, a wife, and a family. I think he doesn't want the humiliation of his wife leaving him for a woman, which he considers, you know, homosexuality, uh, immoral, and, uh, uh, what's the word? He said it's unnatural. Unnatural. <laughs> that was it. Seems like a him problem. Yeah. Well, it certainly is, but... I didn't even realize that. This is why Allison you fucked a, up by getting in a relationship. Yeah, you have a child back there. I'm happy that worked out because it could have been like a conflict of interest trying to get Luther. Never mind. <laughs> yeah. This whole thing just makes me uncomfortable. Yeah, I feel, yeah, mm. I feel kind of bad because for this girl. That's what I'm saying. Even though because it's like I know in, this is going to, this, it's going to end badly very quickly. Yeah, it's like good intentions. I just feel kind of bad for her. It feels like dishonest. Yeah, it's it is dishonest. <laughs> well, me? I don't know. Little of me. I don't know, Bj. Oh boy. <laughs> Diego, come on. Ben's a virgin. We gotta start a cult. <laughs> oh god. Just say you possess Klaus or something. Yeah. Man, this is oh, she's bad gonna use her powers. Well, that 
kind of worked well for five. Yeah, everybody's so selfish. Everyone is incredibly selfish. Well, I don't know. The difference is, though, five, like, had the luxury of not being stuck alone for, like, a couple years. So it makes sense they would start True. a life. With, not like a life, but, I mean, they spent a well, few years here. Well, they did start here. a life. Like, of, five yeah. just showed up when it was time to go. They were yeah. here a few years. Like That's true. Oh, boy, who do you kill? Oh, it's Ellie. Okay. Right. Oh, I forgot about that. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Fucking dummy. Yep. Oh, damn. I'd take that in a second. <laughs> you know, Allison, at least, she's the only one that's willing to not do the selfish move. She's going, yeah, yeah I need to leave. We have to stop the apocalypse. Oh, well, now this is uh, really messing things up. Oh, shit. Oh, that was Neck chop. the best... Play you could ever do against her. Oh shit, blood for blood. Did Luther leave? Oh yeah. So. It's just, this isn't gonna work out. Fucking. <laughs> <laughs> I love that they're using this song yeah. for this. Power. Wow, I didn't even think how good of that, that neck chop was. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! Oh, okay. Oh. Oh, no. Damn. I know the bad guys, this is some fucked up shit. Yeah, this is <laughs> fucked. This is fucked up. And now he's got a dead white man in the house. Yeah, I was just thinking that he's gotta go. I would like to hear a Swedish acoustic version of Backstreet's Back at some <laughs> point, hopefully later in the episode. What the heck? They call it His Carl? cousin's the state trooper or whatever. Oh, oh my no. god. Why'd you leave a note? They only have three of them? Well, Diego's gone. Vanya's stuck. Dealing with the police. Allison's not gonna Allison's a maybe, but I think it might just be the three of them. Oh my god. What if nothing happens? Never mind. Bunch of fucking losers. Everyone's selfish, the problem. Very selfish. You think if you were... Th the thing is... You're gonna it's save the, the world. It's of the planet. Hey, billions of people are gonna die if you just can't say goodbye to your friends or family. Yeah. It's like, well, it's tough. that sucks, but at the same time, it's billions of people. It's also harder people. for Vanya, too, because she doesn't even have memory of this. True. Allison's more forgivable because she got attacked. And she was willing to drop everything and go. Mm hmm Oh, no. Damn, her powers are way better. They yeah. haven't talked about the powers. Oh. Vanya just blew it so fucking bad. And I do get she didn't have a memory of what happened. 
but she really that was all that it. was fast that feel fast yeah that felt quick that was the quickest I'm really like not a lot happened yeah. in that episode well I mean I guess a lot did because everything got totally destroyed I mean I would say a ton happened that episode yeah I don't know it just felt fast I guess I mean all the way back to the uh Five just killing the commission, the committee, the commission. That was yeah, it's that happened right. Right. Yeah, that was sick. That was so cool. That was Man. rad. Axe murderer. You got Luther made it. Diego. They, technically, it was. You know what? I was blaming the whole group, but in reality, at the end of the day, Diego wasn't his fault. Allison, it wasn't her fault. They didn't make it. Luther did make it. Klaus and Ben did make it. It was just Vanya, but Vanya didn't really have the memory. Of the, uh, you know, everything to go back to. Yeah. You know, she didn't realize the highest stakes. So, more forgivable. Yeah, I, I forgot about that, that she didn't have any memory at all. Yeah. It's, it's just so hard when you, they, they had no time. That's the thing. Five, I'm surprised, that I'm, I'm not so sure they should have even gone through that suitcase. Yeah, who knows where that thing could have went. Yeah, and five, uh, I can't, just cause, hey, I just murdered everyone. Oh yeah, I threw a 90 second time, 90 minute timer on it for no reason. Yeah. There was no reasoning behind it. It's just like in a video game. And they're like, you have two minutes to complete this task. And it's yeah. like, why? <laughs> yeah. Didn't make anything change anything. Yeah. I guess she just wanted to. Yo, what up, homie? What up? Also, yeah. what's, what's up with Ray? Because he's got a dead white man at his house. That's true, <laughs> too. Vanya's just got really good control over her power, too, because she could have destroyed everything right there. Yeah, she's definitely more refined. Also, after her attack, uh, good use of non-lethal force by that officer. Yeah. <laughs> yep. And he was dealing with a super villain. Yeah. yeah. And, he, true. and he didn't kill her. Yeah, who is into, according to him, unnatural... Um, relations. Yeah, I would have. I you would think that in he Texas went, too. You think a little yeah, trigger happy? Yeah, you think he'd go right for the <laughs> lethal went, force. You know, someone who's way. willing to approach the driver's side with a loaded <laughs> shotgun. You'd think he'd use. He's it. a little more apprehensive towards using it than I would have expected. Not a bad officer. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah I'm, not, I'm not a fan of his brother-in-law. <laughs> yeah, or his brother? His brother. Yeah, I'm not a fan of his brother, but. uh to be fair, he used uh, police protocol pretty well. And to be fair, she was kidnapping the, the autistic kid. That's true, too. You could have, yeah. She literally was. <laughs> it's just, yeah. It's her kid. You could have said her kid, probably. You could have said Harlan. Harlan. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, she was kidnapping Harlan. There you go. We'll that back in. <laughs> but yeah, that guy's probably okay at his job. <laughs> yeah, that was a good... I'd say it's All good. Right. I'd say it's good. Juice Labs.